Hi everyone, Sabrina Woodworth here with Work Lessons 101 and today's question is why is it important to have a Bible resume? If I don't have one, how do I start and is there a template? So this is a perfect question for, for uh, this week's theme. Um, so Bible resume is what I actually refer to um, uh, and through some of my journey videos as a Bible that chronologically has a great deal of detail of everything you've accomplished in your career from the very beginning to where you currently are at. So I'm 13 years into my career and I don't know about you, I have a very hard time remembering um, what I've done throughout my entire career, um, especially my first few years. So my Bible resume has absolutely everything, everything I've accomplished uh, early in my career, all my volunteer experience, absolutely everything. So when you're applying for a job, you're not going to give them your Bible resume. Absolutely not. Most resumes are between two and three pages tops. If you're a subject matter expert, yeah, those tend to be longer. There's exceptions, but generally a couple pages is all you want. And you want to go through your Bible resume and take the snippets that are important to the job, but you're you're trying to secure um, you know all your accomplishments highlight your accomplishments is the biggest thing instead of your highlighting just your responsibilities make sure the value you brought previous organizations and certain roles are definitely on your resume that's the first thing um, I suggest everyone to have one um, again because you're just you forget what you brought um, over the years and it's a great confidence builder to go back and read like my Bible resume is about 12 pages long now so uh, you know if I'm feeling oh you know my career's dead end reading right now and I'm not motivated I go back and read my Bible resume on uh, boosts a lot of confidence of how far I've achieved and how far I've come as a person and an employee and now a business owner. So I suggest you have one. The template, I wouldn't say you need a template. I, I you know, just throw it in Word. I, the biggest thing there is the content because it's not your resume that you're actually going to give employers. Um, you know, there's tons of te um, templates online and with Word now and just use a nice fancy one that's uh, applicable to your industry. But your Bible resume is primarily the content and so you can take snippets from it and I highly recommend you have one if you don't have one now to start one. Anyways I hope that's helpful uh, as usual please DM me uh, via any of my social medias or my website worklessons101.com for any of your questions and I will address them on video. Thank you! Bye bye!